so. Welcome to Beltane Coven Oven. Today we'll be making a mini Jack in the Green. You'll need scissors, five me four meters of string, and a bunch of grass. You want to take a handful of grass, um, about this this big, um, and then you're going to fold over your floppy tops to make a nice loop. That's going to be your head. Um, then you're going to take the end of your string and just tie a little knot around the middle there. Any old knot, nothing fancy. Um, okay, now you're going to wind around. You're essentially, what you're going to make is a little figure with legs, arms and a little head and a torso. So this bit's going to be the torso. I'm just going to wrap the string around and around. Nicely like that, keeping it all kind of, I mean it doesn't have to be really close together but it looks quite nice I think. And then, windy, windy, windy. When it gets to a certain point where you think, yeah, I reckon legs, maybe a little bit longer. sections there, one leg, two leg, and then you're just going to start wrapping around the legs. So do one leg, like so, looking very nice, gorgeous legs. Don't worry about bits of grass, you can trim them off later or also and just nice aren't they bits of grass um, wind it wind it wind it until you get to its little foot and then I would just chop off his leg just <laughs> no just the end of the string and then tuck that in under your last loop it doesn't need to be that secure to be honest but yeah I just cut all the nails off, I can't do that. I don't have any nails. Oh, it's just simply do that. Tucked under. <laughs> okay, then get another bit of string. Tie it around your second bit, it gets a bit icky. Okay, bring it right up to the crotch, <laughs> as it were. And do another little knot. Quite nice to tuck that bit of string in and then simply wind again okay little foot now we're gonna do our arms so take a slightly smaller bunch of grass smaller than you had for the body and legs um, and you're gonna place it across the back of your little little person like that um, and then just grab some string you're gonna go around the front Oop. around the front and just make sure your grass kind of lying on the back like that and then tie a knot around the back I'll do it and then I'll show you like that just make sure it's nice and tight so you can see it's looking like that. Mm -hmm. It's looking like that. Um, and then you're just gonna go round like you did on the legs. So, and don't worry if it's a bit wonky because you'll do one side first, and then you're gonna cut the string and then tie another piece of the string on, and that will and go up the other arm, and that will make that look a bit less wonky. Tuck that under, 
like so. And then again, go tie another piece of string around the front and go the opposite way. So if your string went from round here last time, you're going to go this way so that it's nice and secure. And then same thing, you're winding. Okay, now it's looking like this. I want to add, I'm going to say a little bit more neck. To, do, do you think it needs more neck? Yeah, and I'm going to add a little bit of neck. So just take another little bit of string, tie it around the back. I'm sort of semi kind of trying to keep all my knots at the back, but it doesn't matter that much. Again, give it a lovely neck. It's very easy to see that's a neck. Right, and now it's your time to clean them up a bit. So I'm just gonna trim the hands, trim the feet, little crackened hooves, a uh, little haircut. Something very gorgeous like that. It looks very cute and sweet. Uh, trim off any bits of grass that are just sort of sticking out anywhere. I mean, you don't have to do this, but I think it will make you feel pleased once you have. Um, and any excess bits of string. Where's that tune, Hannah? Uh, it's from Lord of the Rings. I don't know if you've seen that film. It's very good. Um, okay, a little person! Um, and now, the world's your oyster to decorate hamsoever you would wish. Uh, Goodbye, little friend. Unleash the spirit of summer.